Okay guys, what is going on? This is Greg from AmericanBidetProject.com and in this video I'm talking about one of the most popular electronic bidets on the market. This is the BioBidet BB600 and out of all the bidets in the $300 to $400 range, this is by far the most popular model. This model comes packed with all the features you look for in a solid quality electronic bidet. On this bidet, you can easily control the water pressure, the water temperature, the angle of the nozzle, and of course, the heated seats. All these features are of course controlled by the built-in control panel on the bidet. Now with many electronic bidets, people worry about whether or not the bidet is going to fit their toilet seats, whether or not it's gonna have a good fit, is it going to be comfortable? The BB600 will fit 98% of most toilets. Most people do not have a problem fitting the BB600 on their existing toilet. Installation is very easy. Simply take off your existing toilet seat, bolt in, the mounting bracket, the supplied mounting bracket that comes with the BB600 and then snap the BB600 into place. The bidet comes with everything you need to install including a T connector to split your existing water connection. Installing the T connector is a simple matter of turning off your water, flushing your toilet to drain the water that's in the tank and then securing the T-connector into its proper place. Once you turn the water back on and check that there's zero leaks, you plug the BB600 into the nearest GFI outlet and you're ready to go. Now one thing to note with the BB600 is it does have a slightly larger reservoir tank. The BB600 heats the water by filling the built-in reservoir tank and then supplying the hot water to you as needed. Now this tank sits at the back of the bidet. For some people, larger individuals, it can get in the way as you sit down. But for most people, you will generally not have a problem using the bidet. It's very comfortable for most individuals. Depending on the size of your toilet, the lid of the bidet can take up some real estate on the actual diameter of the hole. It can block some of that available real estate. These are a few things you need to be aware of and all these can be mitigated by measuring your toilet and getting the proper dimensions. This advice is most applicable to users with a round style toilet. If you have an elongated style toilet, you will generally not have a problem at all. If you have any questions about this particular bidet, leave a comment below or visit us online at AmericanBidetProject.com.